if, if, if you're not if you're not weightlifting heavy all week long like what are you recovering from you right. know and that might be a that might be a rough one <laughs> for people right. but i mean really like it like you it's auxiliary of it's an auxiliary movement of weight lifting so if you're not already <clears throat> weight lifting your ass off there's not a magic pill movement right. that's going to make you a better weightlifter mm-hmm. weightlifting will make you a better weightlifter right. and variations of weightlifting um you know there's not a massage that's going to make you snatch more that's upsetting. And unless you've been weightlifting so much that your shoulders are hurt and then a massage makes your shoulders feel better and now you snatch more but yeah. like the thing is like if you're not doing if you're not working the technique and the strength then like i mean why worry about the other shit yet right that's awesome that's the truth right there yeah yeah that's it no it it is basics the case by case like all right what are the one or two things individually isolated they need to work on well most most people are tight hips and bad posture Mm -hmm. like really if you like just dork out on your posture like see how a person's supposed to look when they stand up straight yeah and you know get your hips loose to where you're not like pitched forward or you've got some you know weird pelvis like tilt or you can't pick your knees up past your hip like once you start fixing those things you know for people that are getting started um it makes the sports way easier all sports not just weightlifting but right you know powerlifting field sports whatever whatever you're doing yeah you you made mention of farmers carries i've never heard an Olympic lifter ever tell me that they they would do a farmer's carry at all yeah so you've already kind of kind of damned yourself into this deep rabbit hole we're about to go down with farmers carries. <laughs> so so Okay, what what kind of farmers carries were y'all doing? We would do a dumbbell, and uh, it was I think the way it was programmed on that uh, on that was um, was it body? I think it was body weight, <laughs> which was body weight dumbbells. <laughs> well, total body weight total. So I'd have oh, to okay. use like yeah, I'd have to use like two forty or total whatever, which we didn't yeah. even have. Well, yeah, we did have one twenties, but I like it was at the end of the day I was dragon ass so I, <laughs> I wasn't able to do them but uh i mean you know the goal on them was basically to you know brace good yeah. bracing good posture um because you know what you'll see a lot in uh, olympic weightlifting is people like to use their traps and they want to like support everything on their traps when really you just use like a natural posture like you want your shoulders more like low as possible mm-hmm. and that's like you know how many people do you see try to front squat like here. oh yeah they'll push up yeah right and then they're lightheaded you know like, i get lightheaded on front squat well your posture's <laughs> dog shit <laughs> you're like you're just trying to prop your that is the key uh, barbell <laughs> dog out is the key. yeah yeah what are you what are you supporting that weight with you know like you gotta you gotta get your chest big and, and let your shoulders be down and, and use mm-hmm. good posture but yeah so that i think that it just sort of uh it ingrained that bracing and that that good posture you know it, by the end of the day like like I said, you're, you're tired from having to keep your shoulders pinned back on every lift. Right. You pick up those dumbbells and you just want to like slash forward. You know? Right. So Dave's yelling at you to not drop them and stay yeah. tight. <laughs> so yeah, uh, that's kind of how they were, uh, they were used. Um, but I, I don't, I'm sure they're still on programs, but like, like Jack and Tan used to be a cow strength staple that we did every year. Um, mm-hmm. And they were always never, never to fail on Monday evenings after the the heavy training i think we had back squat tens on monday nights as well so we were ready to all quit but yeah right. <laughs> that's the reward yeah did you did you always use straps with that because grip wasn't really the issue it was more of like just staying we uh position. dave would let us sometimes okay depending on what the day looked like how people were taxed coaches yeah on. yeah it was sort of like a it was like a pussy move um <laughs> you, can use the straps, you can use the straps as long as they match your purse That's right right coach is gonna make and, i mean I, i'm not gonna say act like i didn't do it but <laughs> I have to be like, i'm a pussy and then wrap them up right yeah. <laughs> that's how it goes yeah uh-huh. oh what's your what's your deal with the farmer's carry i feel like you got like a no no i mean it could be big fan or, or vendetta or what no i love i love a farmer's carry yeah. i love strongman work like whenever i yeah. work with an athlete and dustin's the same mindset it's just strongman if you bang for buck yeah bang for buck if i had to have him do like 
one thing outside of what their actual test is like your snatch clean and jerk yeah i'd have them do some type of really horrible taxing strong men it, that's just yeah it's movement it's yeah. pure it? movement it's quasi isometric and if you can hone yeah. in on what dave's selling you those those pinning back and down and you're getting that quasi isometric control endurance that's gonna that's a base it's, a giant base man, it's the it's the ultimate capacity sport in yes. it i mean like it's as, as much weight usually as many times as possible yep. or it's as, yeah. as much weight as fast as possible right you know like it, everything it, it's More it's different. basically like crossfit times 100 yes I yes mean, the, the the intensity times 100 right I, yeah yeah that's that's really funny you say that because i've always told people competitive crossfit uh, individual crossfit that level when you're at like the regional the games level yeah you are doing a strongman competition for the average human yeah it's it's like, like average size human that's what it is yeah. that's what it's it is. marathon strongman marathon there you go yeah. <laughs> yeah.